We are continuing to drive change by profiling a group of men and women in uniform who are responsible for keeping watch over our streets and our kids, especially before and after the school bell. Yeah, not the police, but those crossing guards. News 5's Renee Skinner spoke to a man who's been a crossing guard for six years and says he's got plenty of experience dealing with all kinds of drivers. On the corners of Montbello and Meadowland. All right, you too, buddy. A pair of District 11 crossing guards. One in a skirt. You guys be safe walking up the hill. The other in blue jeans. Y'all have a good snow day yesterday. Never too cold on a day like this to speak to Mr. Joe Craven. He spent the past six years at intersections like this. Yeah, it's a little slick. Where there's all types of weather and all types of drivers. You've got more about me and less about what's around me and who else is out here with me? Mr. Craven isn't shy about calling out bad drivers. People are just self-centered anymore. They don't, they don't care. Especially when he meets people who drive without braking. I'm in a hurry. Get out of my way. And manners. And you got to figure that. Well, their mama didn't raise them right. Joe says every mother's concern should be her kids. Same goes for drivers who enter a school zone. Slow down. That's. That may not be your kid, but it's somebody's kid. Yeah, some great talk there from Joe. Renee Skinner reporting. He sounds like a great guy. And Joe also says that drivers need to be practicing giving themselves enough time to get to work every morning. If you allow plenty of time, there's no rush. And if you're late, that's yeah. fine too. As we work to find solutions for everything from crash safety to crumbling streets and beyond, we still need your help. So email us your thoughts and concerns at drivingchange at koaa.com or make it really easy. You can message us through our Driving Change Facebook group.